In this session, we're going to show you how to optimize the view for IPA. You're going to want to make sure that your spreadsheet fits within the confines of your monitor, similar to what we have here in this image. First, let's take a look at what it might look like if you had the wrong resolution when you opened IPA. In this case, I'm operating at a resolution of 1366 by 768. And this is the display that I get. You can see everything's cut off. Uh, I'm going to have to scroll over here to the right. I'm going to have to scroll up and down in order to get to the information I need. This is not optimal. In order to change this so that it's optimized, the first thing that we're going to have to do is go to the desktop, right click on it, go to display settings, and select your monitor. Once you're in your monitor, you're going to go down to resolutions and you're going to set the resolution from whatever it is now to 1920 by 1200. Keep the changes and close. And when you come back to IPA, you'll see that it fits nicely within the confines of your monitor. You can see the investment, you can see the due diligence, you can see exit strategies and your graphs for analytics. This makes it nice so that when you're operating within IPA and changing and making modifications, you can see everything happening dynamically. If we go back to the home page, you'll see at the top here in the upper right hand corner, IPA is best viewed at 1920 by 1200, so if you ever forget, you can always come back. For those of you who are operating at a resolution of something less than 1920 by 1280, we've included a zoom feature for you. So here you can actually set the zoom percentage and it'll zoom accordingly. When you click back on the zoom sheet, it'll go back to the default, which is 1920 by 1280. I hope this session was helpful and if you have any questions, please email us at support at revivalbrothers.com. Thank you.